hello everyone it's me asmr welcoming you to my new tutorials and today i'll show you the mid journey alpha uh, just couple months ago uh, at least one month ago i i just uh, explored this one mid journey alpha because of uh, not all of the user are uh, just getting this mid journey alpha because of they just given some users those who are the old to using mid journey and uh, that is the uh, alpha or test basis and uh, that is pretty much easy to generate something in this mid journey uh, the first generation or the previous um, system of making mid journey photos uh, in a discord that was good but uh, mid journey alpha is um, like competitive things with the other ai like uh, dali like stable diffusions uh, playground or most importantly the adobe firefly so let's see what just they given in this mid journey alpha and uh, how it's helping us for making or generating image easily and uh, let's start the tutorial if you're new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications <music> If you log in to the mid journey then you will get here first of all you will get the explore option you can explore everything over there and here the plus sign meaning you have the option to upload any sort of image over there otherwise if you don't want to upload any image you can write prompt over here here is the menu options burger menu or whatever here the aspect ratio or size here is a slide bar you can easily slide that things like 2 by 3 9 is to 9 is to 16 and 1 by 2 whatever you can ratio set with this sliding bar here is a portrait option square option and landscape option that is the easiest three things 3 by 4 square and 4 by 3 that is the easiest template but you can roll over and you can slide this bar to set your aspect ratio suppose i want to make 3 by 2 so here is 3 by 2 in a landscape portion if i take this one into the portrait portion that is also has 3 by 2 okay you can reset this option if you reset it will provide you the square portion or square ratio aspect ratio here is the aesthetics aesthetics uh, in this portion stylization uh, which is called the stylize uh, we uses that thing stylization uh, you know stylization meaning uh, what type of style it will be it will be um, uh, like a portrait or it will be the real type image or illustration type image it defines with the stylization and then weirdness sometimes we are uh, making some weird type of illustration or photo like combination of cabbage and the uh, uh, like uh, eating itself or some uh, like uh, weird photographs which is just for the fun and here is the weirdness you can use weirdness to make that type of images here is the variety which is another name is chaos you can make lots of varieties things with that meaning when you're giving the prompt you will get four options and in the each options you will get lots of varieties here you can reset the options you can use the number by sliding that things if you want to provide weirdness you can do here is the varieties in the discord what we did uh, we just uh, given here double hyphen in stylization everything and here the standard mode and draw mode here and version you can choose the version from here all the version already added over there uh, version 1 2 3 4 5 6 and the downside niji 4 5 6 you can use lots of things over there and after that here is the relax fast and turbo that's good if you provide prompt over there you can just provide or generate these things here is the create options 
you are uh, getting the output of your creations and then archive what you created it will be archived in this portion and you can just select all the stuffs at a time and press the download you can download all the stuffs in in a zip file so you don't have to download one by one from the scratch or from here so select all deselect all here are lots of filters like uh, here how many you liked then hidden how many hidden here is the grid how many grid you used over there version 6 it will show you the filter version 5 how many uh, generation or the photo i made in a version 5 and see more one two three so in one first generation second generation third generation fourth generation and five generation all will provide you in a filter mode after adding the filter mode here is a full small medium large and the third or row all the stuffs just sorted over there and you have the option to filter that all here is the red image that is for the developer mode and the red ideas uh, how many idea you can provide over there assign here point assign you can do that and leaderboard how many the developer and how many just uh, uh, idea they shared over there if you want you can share idea you can enlist in a later board and news how many new feature they are providing here they are providing a news over there and here some uh, light mode and like a dark mode and here is the create options so let's get something in these options so here is uh, i'll write down anything or i have a options which is the image to prompt so trying another image here that is the image to prompt options and already so here is a car and i'll open it up and generate the prompt here i'm using the image generation image to prompt that is free and if you provide photo over there it will provide you the like text or another way to make image to prompt which is the mm, gpt gpt is good uh, if you upload the gpt uh, a photo into the gpt and uh, if you tell um, uh, gpt to explain the photo it will explain you can use two of them so in my gpt i am using 3.5 which is free here is the sign which is the attachment sign and after that if i attach anything suppose here is the car and writing over there explain the photo and just hit the enter button it's explaining me the image show the white lamborghini sports car parked on a so all the written note will copy and then going to the mid journey so after going to the mid journey here is our parameter options so i want to make this one landscape which is three by two landscape and aesthetics i'll make it 900 and the chaos i'll make it 10 and standard and first generation mode and here i'm using the version 6 and just press the enter and it will provide you the amazing photograph in this output let's see uh, what they are providing so our output is ready two three and four four output we already got and previously i made something uh, which is like vr um, uh, or metaverse type um, things which is uh, uh, for my uh, work and now i just uh, given the demonstration how to make these things so hope that you learn a lot from this video in the next video we'll talk about the similarities and like uh, uh, the similar photo reference and mid journey what they are acting and what is the new feature they brought to you 
Hope that you learned a lot from this video. If you did, please thumbs up and share with your friend. And if you have any sort of questions, query, or request, please do comment in my video comment section. Until the next video, as I am signing out today, stay safe, stay healthy, keep me in your prayers, and bye bye.